14 bolt strap down here at the table. Got the pinion tool all uh, secured on the yoke here. Got a piece of square tubing to uh, extend the handle on it. And then the three foot, uh, three quarter inch ratchet wrench is ready to go. So, uh, <clears throat> the nuts are loosened up a little bit for now. So we'll tighten it back down and then just gotta keep tightening it until something breaks. Uh, also, to get some sort of reference for how much torque is on here, uh, with this being, you know, you measure in foot pounds. So for every foot from the center line of the fastener, however much weight you put on it or uh, force is foot pounds. So I'm about 200 pounds. So at one foot, uh, that would be 200 foot pounds, and then 400, 600. And then if we have to, we're going to get a, a pipe out and break something. So here we go. Yeah. You can see a little extender over here. Oh, a little deep hole. Got a little bump in the bottom too. Oh yes. Well, didn't hit that is sharp hole. So it's a success. Straight and narrow. Ah, <laughs> With a dimple on the bottom. <laughs> We're all set up here. You might not be able to see too well on the camera, but we have the uh, different increments here. Basically, each foot, another 200 pound torque, foot pound. Got the high speed camera set up. Probably start here, 600. Move our way out. Safety first. Eight hundred's good. Thousand. Straps kind of in the way. Alright, this wasn't long enough, so got the old extendo. More one inch round stock coming in handy. Some DON. So again, we had 200, 400, 600, 800, 1,000 foot pounds, 1,200. Had to get the extension out. 
1400, I think is where we were at. So, I guess that is where it starts to bend things. So, you can see, definitely not straight anymore. Also, it looks like the plate bent a little bit, like right in here. I'm thinking I'm gonna end up just giving it a little more meat in here. Add some there where it necks down. Keep it a little wider. Definitely bent, but I just don't think there's any reason to go any beefier on this thing. That was just way overkill. And I'm pretty happy with that. No cracked welds or anything. So some other damage found this big old mark in the uh, in the housing. That is definitely pushed out. But did its job, held it in place. Oh, wow. <laughs> so I think it's a pretty successful test. 1,400 pounds is, uh, foot pounds, is definitely well beyond what it needs to be. So yeah, I'm happy with it. I'm definitely gonna tweak the uh, plate part a little bit. Um, like I said, put a little more meat on on that section, but otherwise, I'd say it's, uh, it's pretty solid.